The inauguration of President Joe Biden and Vice President Kamala Harris should have put an end to the grip that Trump tried to maintain on the White House, and it did. But some more extreme supporters continue to lean into delusions about how the twice-impeached Queen's native could somehow retain power. On the QAnon chatroom of the social media app Telegram, posters continue to believe the oath of office Biden took still didn't seal the deal to his presidency. Instead, admins urged followers to continue to keep the faith that a Democrat will not serve as the 46th President of the United States. Just because Trump is leaving office for now does not follow Biden will be president, a post on the page, with nearly 30, ooh subscribers, said. The military is sorting through the mess and a new president will be a month or so away. Followers of QAnon and some other far-right groups believed Wednesday would be the Great Awakening. Some forecasted that when Donald Trump boarded Air Force One to leave the White House, Americans would be alerted by the emergency broadcast system of his intent to remain in power and that martial law would be enacted in cities run by Democrats. They believed Democratic leaders would be arrested for running a global sex trafficking ring, the myth that fuels their group, and those arrests would secure Trump's second term in office. But when their phones didn't buzz at noon with the news of mass arrests or a successful coup, some believers tried to tweak their theory so the cult-like organization could continue despite the collapse of their failed prophecy. On Wednesday morning, admins to QAnon chats on Telegram continued to peddle nonsense to followers, promising that Biden would not be inaugurated. Grasping at signs of a coming win, they celebrated seeing 17 flags on the stage of Trump's farewell speech, and the news that Biden would sign 17 executive orders when he entered the White House. They took the coincidences as a nod to QAnon, as Q was the 17th letter of the alphabet. Another QAnon theory circulating the internet is that Trump will continue to lead the country as a shadow president for the next four years. It's unclear how much of a following this concept has. Perhaps the most jarring performance of mental gymnastics was spewed by the Q supporters who shared a theory that the newly elected Democratic President Joe Biden has actually been part of QAnon all along, and that he would be the one to bring down the mythical Democrat lead sex trafficking ring. The initial influencer who shared the theory to Telegram started walking it back after she came under attack. There is no truth to the beliefs espoused by the QAnon conspiracy theory and its followers. Trump supporters clash with police and security forces as they storm the U.S. Capitol in Washington, D.C. on January 6, 2021.